what's up loves welcome back hope everyone is having an amazing day so i've just done some grocery shopping for the month um i started today with where did we go we went to costco and then after that hit up walmart and then hit up dollar general for just some, just some odds and ends that um i needed to grab so I am still going to Aldi tomorrow, so I will have that at the end of the video. But for now, let's start with uh, what we got at Costco. Didn't actually get much at Costco. So we'll start over here. Got some two bags of kale because everybody loves kale, whether in a salad or stewed, it's amazing. Got some bread, got a 54 case of Pete's K-Cups. The coffee is so good. We really go through a lot of coffee in this house. And I actually got more coffee. <laughs> and I think Walmart and then in Dollar General. Got three containers of half and half because, hello, we go through a lot of coffee. And two containers of heavy cream um, for the kitties. Got some crispy chicken strips. And then back here, these fish sticks, which to me are like the best fish sticks ever. Got a whole bag of lemons back here. Got a bag of limes. Baby carrots because the kids and the rabbits. Hello, rabbits eat carrots. Big bag of asparagus, delicious. When I say we love Brussels sprouts in this house, I'm actually surprised I only grabbed one that's weird for me over here i've got some mozzarella cheese and some ricotta because there is a birthday coming up and a little someone loves his lasagna and got butter lettuce because i truly love butter lettuce these aluminum trays which they are heaven sent vegetable oil because there's a lot that's going on between cooking and baking this month then here I got some meat here. So the top one is just ground, um, not ground, just beef stew. The next one underneath I think is the ground beef. Yep, that's for the lasagna. And then I have these two pieces of meat here. I forgot what these are called, but I like to stick those in the crock pot with lots of vegetables and potatoes. Wonderful. A hot Italian sausage because when I make lasagna I mix the hot sausage in with the ground meat and they love it I got this whole pork loin which let me remove the eggs because I got the what is this five dozen egg case and honestly guys I probably should have gotten another one and underneath that is that big pork loin which I cut up and that becomes a number of meals and then Four sticks, four pounds of butter, which I probably should have gotten another one of those as well. And now this is the Walmart. <laughs> this is so, where, where do I start? Okay, we'll start over here. I got a crap load of shrimp, different sizes. Got about eight different bags. Got what, small, got some jumbo, got some medium. I even think I got large back there. Then I got these uh, spicy pork sausages for them for breakfast. I got some different cold cuts. There's turkey. There's ham. I got my um, buffalo chicken patties. They're vegan. They are delish. Then I got three jars of the marinara sauce because like I said we have a birthday and the little birthday boy wants his lasagna. So I got three jars of that. Just some decorations to uh go on his birthday cake and his favorite color is green to match his eyes so mint oreo cookies that is actually part of his birthday cake then i like getting these different packs of muffins they're like 89 cents i want to say or 87 cents and they're quick to do in the morning especially on cooler days turn the oven on do a quick one or in the summertime even to put it in my toaster oven i've got a huge toaster oven that usually actually sits in this area and i bake everything in there i wrote i do rotisserie chickens in there amazing then i've got some of the um betty crocker cookie mixes i actually have a few more of those somewhere in here <laughs> got a whole lot of chocolate chips and this is a new one i've never seen the maple one so i'm excited to get that and the white chips whole lot of those sazon tostare some southern cornbread mix i've never tried this before i always make my cornbread from scratch but i was 
feeling like cheating. So I grabbed that one. Um, I live in a household full of chocoholics. So I've got these dark chocolate um, swirl thingies to put on desserts. I actually think this one is, is first, blah, blah, blah. it says from the coffee house flavor. I don't know. And then um, I got this just to swirl on different desserts and stuff that we do here. I got a big bag of candy. I love when the fall comes out because then they start preparing for Halloween and I load up on these bags of different candies. Um, got a oil, olive oil Gnostic spray, 1850. This coffee is so delicious. When I tell you Folgers, you got a fan right here. This 1850 coffee is amazing. The K-Cups are delicious. I got two of them, y'all. <laughs> but I think I got two different flavors. This is sweet cream. And the other one is, this is vanilla. Sorry if the lighting's off. Um, I got two of the Welch's Jam because my sister loves a good peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Or in my case, creamy almond butter. Yes. Uh, dangerous. I'm not even going to respond to that one. When you got kids, you got to have Swiss Miss, right? Some rice, a big 10 pound bag of white rice. I don't even eat rice. Some chicken thighs. Why did I get this when I had just gone into Costco's? I have no idea. So I got a crap load of cheeses here for tons of recipes for the month. And the great value ones are the Walmart brand. <laughs> Amazing, delicious, no different, except in your pockets. Hello. So I've got like the sharp cheese, jalapeno, habanero. I've got lots of mozzarella again. Birthday boy wants lasagna. This because it's amazing to use to get your cakes and cookies out. Mayonnaise, buttermilk pancake mix, cause ah, yeah, we're not even gonna go there. And some old fashioned oats. So that is everything from Walmart. Oh, I also, <laughs> I got this because I completely forgot that in Costco I had already gotten one and when I got to Walmart I said oh I forgot to get ground meat now I got ground meat and then when I got home I realized that today I was actually supposed to make meatloaf so that is why I ended up actually getting two one for meatloaf and the other one for the lasagna but a sister is not making meatloaf tonight I am done okay and finally for today tomorrow I'm going to Aldi's um today i uh, blah 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 <laughs> guys i'm so tired so this is donner donner oh my goodness dollar general just some random stuff dollar general for me is like a fun quick run store okay so i got a mat for the um bathroom tub they only had white or beige i was hoping for something different so i just went ahead and got the beige Got some more baking chips. It's funny, I, I had this on my um, Amazon and it was like 19 bucks. <laughs> and I got this for, what's it, like $4.99. And then I got the Ab Wheel, which I wanted to get to as well. Some sweetened coconut. Guys, this is so good, but keep it away from me because I literally will eat it out of the bag. Um got one of these for my shadow for my baby boo my they love corn dogs they really do okay guys i told you we go through a lot of coffee right well the mccafe had new ones that my right aid did not carry but dollar general had them hello colombian espresso roast and french vanilla you guys have to remember that with the really flavored ones they are light. You, it's very rare that you're going to find a espresso strength with a flavor. Um, yeah. So I have a major sweet tooth. Okay, don't judge me. So Mike and Mike's, these are my faves. Sour Patch, because I love sour. Starburst, just because. And some candy corn. I literally just finished a bag of candy corn like two days ago. Some stuff's combos. Movie night almonds because they're healthy and they look good here in the middle of all the the junk food some potato chips um let's just plain because i'm a plain chip girl dorito spicy nacho for everybody else 
some Ziploc bags, foil. I needed some new Tupperware to put stuff in and pack up. And I needed two new spoons. And then I got this um, torch lighter for cigars. Yeah. Ooh, feel the power. Hey guys, welcome back. Another day, another store, uh, same grocery haul for September. I am super tired. My head has been throbbing, but today we did Aldi's, Target. I got a few things from TJ Maxx and Burlington Coat Factory, just some things for the house, and I will show you those as well. Okay, so for this is all Aldi's. Didn't get as much as I thought I would from Aldi's. My, my Aldi's runs are always focused in the canned food goods. And I actually didn't get as much as I normally do because they were missing quite a few stuff in that store, quite a few stuff, quite a few items. But I basically got lots of canned veggies back there. So we've got some string beans, sliced carrots, mixed vegetables. This stockpile is all different beans, pinto, cannellini, um, garbanzo, black beans, red beans. Got some refried beans for tacos, diced tomatoes. I usually load up on the small cans of tomato paste, tomato sauce, but they had none of that. They only had the diced tomatoes, so I got some of those. Some of the canned pumpkins, some canned yams. Lots of evaporated milk because when half and half goes, <laughs> that's what, you know, creams my coffee. Over here, more canned vegetables. So I've got corn, French style green beans, cut green beans, and some more mixed vegetables. The mixed vegetables are really good in soups. Got some maple syrup, got some raw honey back there. A spice that looks interesting, amazing burger. So I'm probably going to use that in the meatloaf. <laughs> Um, hazelnut spread, which tastes just as good as Nutella. I've got olive oil and then I've got avocado oil. Two of the cocoa powders for baking, some tartar sauce, some quinoa for days that I actually want a grain. Cocktail sauce for whatever you use cocktail sauce for. <laughs> They're gravy packets. These things are like 30 cents and they're so freaking good. Um, got some cold cuts here, it's turkey, ham, and I think the other one is chicken. These freeze wonderfully, um, and I'm going to put them in a the freezer because I have one from yesterday that's already open. So these will go in the freezer. I got different um, bars. So I've got some chocolate chip bars, um, granola bars. Those are great, actually, breakfast <laughs> for the kids with a piece of fruit. And then I've got these that I'm more in the... I guess I don't want to say adult ish but yeah you get it so some egg whites because I don't always want a whole egg sometimes I just want like an egg omelet with just the egg white I don't know I'm weird broccoli they had a large honey nut Cheerios and I felt like it was cheaper than even at Rite Aid after my 20% so I got one there baby spinach and arugula it's all I really eat for my salads more baking stuff some um what do you call this? Uh, confectionery sugar, two packs, some pork sausage. I miss these here. Diced peaches and a mandarin oranges. Sometimes that's what the little ones eat. And then more baking stuff, some chocolate chips, some pecans, some chopped pecans, some coconut, and some light brown sugar. These are the hash brown patties. <sighs> Love those. Put an egg on top of it and you're good to go. Radishes for my salad. Saw this buffalo style chicken wings. That looks like a lunch meal. Some lactose free milk because they don't carry lactate. Got some a half a gallon of regular milk because I still have the other whole gallon in there. Two things of applesauce, one with cinnamon and one plain, and then some croutons for when we have our Caesar salad with grilled shrimp. I absolutely detest Caesar salad. I mean croutons but the kids love it so yeah that is everything from Aldi's okay guys so these are the last one two three four stores for today um this is all from Target 
So I got my Gardein stash here, guys. And I tell you that I love these Grabbers Grab Cakes. Let me just stress to you how I love them. Okay. They did come out with some skip meals and I wanted to try them. So I just got one of the two that were available. This is the rigatoni and sausage. Again, this is meat free. This is vegan. And then chicken Florentino. I wanted to try those out. So I just got one just to see how they are in case I didn't like them. But like I said, I love these crab crab cakes and they are not available everywhere. I've been fiending for a chai, so I just got their Simply Balanced Dirty Chai Tea Latte. Uh, I want to try that, see how that tastes. Advil, because headaches, more bacon, I just got some butterscotch morsels, um, cookies and screen M&Ms, because they just look so cute. <laughs> Green grapes, my love. And then I got this egg replacer for all your baking needs and such. So this was Burlington Coat Factory. I need to zoom out. <laughs> Three spices I got. One is garlic bread spice blends. This one is dragon head habanero, habanero spice blends. And then this one is smoked paprika garlic garlic chili and chives spice blends um <laughs> i got some caramel popcorn here because that is definitely a weakness and you hear those offsprings and then i got a um, roasting pan this one is from delmonico's kitchen i saw one on amazon it was like 60 bucks but this is a nice heavy duty non-stick um and it comes with the rack as well and the one i had on my cart on amazon was like 60 bucks and i was just not paying that and this one was 19 but it was marked down and i wonder what it was marked down from uh 40 dollars. so it was half off not bad local meat market i got one of my kids has a love of bologna scallions more eggs this i'm gonna leave in the bag because i need to clean them and everything so this is just oxtails this is a case of oxtails then i got these pork thing not pork these are beef and these are good for a quick simple soup to do make the broth take the meat off add some vegetables and even some pasta if you want and that's a good quick lunch and then over here, I got some goat. <laughs> so that would be divided up. Okay, sorry, no, this is the oxtail. That was the goat. I'm all backwards. So this is the goat. And then here is the oxtail. And I'll actually divide this into about two to three meals. This goat is one meal. And then lastly, in TJ Maxx, got some sea salt popcorn, a uh, lunch pack that was needed. This is my favorite candle. <laughs> when I say favorite, I mean whenever TJ Maxx or Burlington Coat Factory has this, I buy every one that they have. And would you believe they only had one? I was so pissed today. And then just a, uh, a bowl for my lemons and my limes. And then I got this pumpkin spice flavored sauce to drizzle over desserts and everything. So that is it, guys. That is it. That is it. Oh, sorry. Here I am. Sweaty as ever. I'm so hot. I'm so tired. That is it. I do have a Fresh Direct order coming in tonight and an Amazon Fresh order tomorrow. And that is it for my groceries. So those two will be in a separate um, video because I already feel like this video is too long as it is. Love you guys and I hope you have an absolutely amazing day. Be blessed.